Good morning, survivors, and welcome back to the infected. Another day to live through. Better get started. I know it's been a while since I played any infected. Um, I went away for a while. <laughs> a week in Yosemite Park in California um, to visit my son who had just climbed El Capitan and just got back. And now we're ready to get started in earnest back with uh, Infected and other games as well. So, yeah. What were we doing again? <laughs> I don't quite remember. Um, however, let's go around here and collect all the rocks. We need all the rocks. So, I think what we're going to do today, in fact, is go to the one of the villages. We need to go back to the village. Uh, let's see. We got, we got tech from this village, tech from that village. We didn't get two techs from this village down here. And there's one there, there, and I think, oh, one here. So we still have a lot of technology to get. And I want to make, um, I want to make some power. I want to get some power going in this house. Um, I know we can make, actually, right now, I know we can make a solar panel. That is a technology we had found. So we can make this right now. Five ingots, uh, iron ingots, five aluminum. Oh, wait, I don't think we have aluminum. I don't think we have the aluminum, actually. No, we only have four aluminum and aluminum. aluminum. All right, well, we can get more aluminum possibly off of Vambies or at the town or maybe uh, in one of the caves or something. Did we never finish this thing? We didn't. Lead ingots. That's all it needs. All right, well, let's do that. Let's throw some lead on there. Get that chemistry table done at the very least. That shouldn't be too difficult. We've got plenty of lead. Uh, was it three lead or four lead? I think it was only three. And you got one extra. Oh, there we go. Popped right up, and it's nothing. It's just a blank table. <laughs> so what can we make on the chemistry table? I do remember that we can make um, we can make first aid kits, right? Medical kit crafted at the chemistry table. Other than that, I'm not really sure. Oh, we need the advanced workbench too. That's kind of going to be kind of critical. So yeah, maybe we'll get two good techs today, and then we can start focusing on some more advanced. Um, technologies and so forth. I'd love to get power in here because we can make like refrigerators. Uh, where's a refrigerator? Yeah, right here. A fridge would be great. We need that technology. Um, a sink. We can make a sink actually right now. That much we have. We can get clean water out of that. Oh, that would be great. That way we don't have to run to the uh, tuna pond and cook up the water all the dang time. In fact, how are we doing for water and everything? Oh gosh. Um, let's go ahead and eat. I think we got some, some food in here somewhere. Oh, yeah, here we go. <laughs> we got a watermelon right here. No, don't, don't pick it up. Drop it. Harvest it. And why is my dog going crazy upstairs? I don't know. Uh, let's eat this watermelon. And we got some protein. I think we got some tuna out here, in fact, cooking up. Already cooked. Look at that. Grab it. Grab it and eat it. It's bright and early in the morning, so we have a whole day ahead of us. It's going to be glorious. We'll bring... Wow! Here comes Fred! Or Sally. Oh, it's Fred. Hi, Fred. Hi, Fred. Wow! Hey! Oh, yo, 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 yo! So mean! First thing in the morning, really? You couldn't just wait? Coming to see you. Coming to see you soon. So, Fred and Sally, our friends and our neighbors, um, apparently have a new skill set. They do, like, a teleportation thing now. And they also... I guess evaluate you. They can look at you from afar and decide whether or not they want to attack or just walk away. <laughs> Apparently, Fred was angry with me, so he decided to attack. Oh, there's a new key now to get rid of things out of your hand. I've been asking for that forever. So that's super duper nice. All right, let's get ready to roll. We have one lead over here, and we're going to get going. We're going to get going. Like I said, we got the whole day ahead of us. I want to. It's, it's going to be a long hike to that uh, that village, so I think we should do it. Um, yeah, I think we're good as far as food and water. I'm going to grab um, grab the first aid kit just in case. Oh, we should make some clothes, too. We only have one Kevlar, though. Uh, maybe we can't make clothes, because clothes will provide some armor, and that could be good for us. Where is the uh, it's placeables? We need armor and clothes. Kevlar 4. We don't have enough Kevlar for most of the armored stuff. Nor do we have a cloth for anything else. Oh, the pants would be really nice. Look at that. Six cloth. I think we have some cloth. We have three cloth here. What does it take to make cloth? We have a loom, so we should be able to make cloth, right? 
armor and cloths resources is there any cloth in here what's that plant fiber other uh, oh here we go okay so plant fiber and bark chips oh that's easy that's easy we can do that let's make some clothes we've got plenty of plant fiber oops grab the whole caboodle kitten caboodle and bark barky chips it's gonna be a little scratchy isn't it this clothing <laughs> but it will protect us anyway all the apocalypse elves dropping stuff off for us outside that's very nice of them all right let's take a look at that show it was just it was just six cloth right so how do we make the cloth again can we make bulk cloth oh yeah we can 15 plant fiber 25 bark chips 15 plant fiber oh my gosh here comes a neighbor it's sally hi sally fred was just here you just missed him he was heading home um, I seem to be losing materials through my loom. Oh, it's falling right out the back. What's going on? Um, I think my loom is bugged. Oh. <laughs> I'm a fool. I'm gonna drag it over here, not on top of that thing. Oh my gosh. Give me a break. It's Friday. That's my excuse, and I'm sticking to it. 25. There we go. We got 10 cloth now. Let's do six for pants, four for shirt. Um, we have snow pants, but it's gonna be too hot. Oh boy. All right Okay, this is getting crazy now. My pants are not gonna fit in here. Are they we're gonna have to go finish up the clothing rack Let's put that bow down put the bow down um, What is this again super expensive five iron ingots for this thing, which is why I haven't made it yet. That's nuts That is nuts five iron ingots whatever. Let's do it one two three four five and we need screws all right yeah this clothing rack is really expensive which is why i have avoided making it all this time so let's put the cargo pants here Wait, how do you put the things oh that's for shoes i guess yep okay we hang these on the rack oh look at that <laughs> that's actually pretty cool and we'll take these pants off let's hang up these pants grab these pants put them on Okay, so now we're good. Let's go grab our coat. Yeah, I probably should have done all this before off camera, but it's fun to do this stuff with you guys, right? Yeah, look at that. Very nice, worth every penny and every screw. Um, all right, so now what time is it? Nine o'clock, we gotta get going. It's pouring rain out, but I wanna, I wanna get to that town and to get some tech. So without further ado, Let's put everything away here, and let's boogie. So I got the pants, got the shirt, it's better than nothing. All right, before we go, before we go to town and do some shopping, I wanted to show you something that I had found out here that is new. Uh-oh, what the heck? I'm freezing? Why am I freezing? Dude, it's March. It's March, spring. It's a beautiful day, 42 degrees. Must be these new pants. <laughs> All right, well, let's take these pants off and put the snow pants back on. I think these are, like, super-duper air-conditioned or something, and uh, it's causing me to cool down so much so that I'm taking damage. Wow. Wow, those are great pants. They're going to be great in the summer, but it's still March. And by the way, there's a new setting um, where you can control the length of, oh, gosh, of the seasons. And they, it was 60 minutes per season. Oh, hi, Sally. Um, yeah, so now you can um, you can change the seasons to... Well, I doubled it. So I made it 120 minutes. So that should give us at least maybe two episodes per season. I really kind of... I like the winter a lot. But it went so fast. It's, it's kind of a shame. So, yeah. So I, I I'm, now we're at 120 minutes. So we should get get a longer spring and a longer summer a longer winter a longer fall all that we still have the four seasons anyway all right let's go look for the new thing because it was a patch and a bunch of new stuff was added there's some kind of a stone grinder that sounds really cool but what i'm mostly interested in is the new i don't want to say it and spoil it until we find one but i don't see it there was one here there was there was one here but i think maybe sally or fred Came over and plucked it, brought it home. It was an onion. So there we go. I let I let the onion out of the bag. It was an onion. 
and it seems to be gone now so hopefully we can find another onion in the future and I can't believe it's raining again what is that another melon wow all right well we got plenty of food but no onions that's too bad I guess that's just random those things just pop up randomly because there was an onion there I swear it and I, I left it so we could look at it together <laughs> and go ooh, ah onion just bring one little melon with us sure all right let's buggy let's buggy so where are we going we're gonna go to this town over here I guess so pretty easy to get to just go due west goodbye piggy wiggy we'll see you later all right heading out due west to the new village uh, it's 11 o'clock we should have plenty of time and I'll keep my eyes open for onions so we can have a look at that and make some onion soup but we need to we need to make a stove which is like super expensive and we need to power the stove up so oh boy we got company whoa it's a leaper it's Sally <laughs> Hi, Sally. Fancy meeting you here. I guess she was on her way home, and she gave us two medicated bandages. Very, very nice. Oh, here we are. I see buildings and civilization, <laughs> such as it is. Let's go see if Fred and Sally are home. Um, and we'll do this systematically, one building at a time. Oh, someone's here. Sa oh, Fred. Hi, Fred. Hi, Fred. <laughs> Hi, Fred. Fred, is that a knife in your hand? Are you going to bring me that nice knife? I think so. I think he wanted to show me his his new knife. Show and tell. All right, lovely. Let's do this systematically. I don't know how big this town is, but we'll start with this building here. Kind of work our way around. We'll get the two techs, and then we'll boogie. It's already getting late. It's 2 o'clock in the afternoon already. That's a long hike, man. Super long hike. Ooh, let's put that arrow where it belongs. All right, let's go inside. I don't think the Vambies spawn inside, do they? I don't think so. So I don't worry about things indoors. Potato sprouts, there we go. We got two potato sprouts. The first thing we find in the house, isn't that ironic? <laughs> I wanted to find one in the ground, but uh, we got the sprouts and now we can grow them. There's another med kit. Let's go left around the world, look for our tech. It's gonna be in a bookshelf, of course. We are in the bathroom, and looks like more potato sprouts. Please don't tell me we're just going to get potato sprouts. Looks like they're potato farmers here, maybe. Nothing on that little shelf. Yeah, most of these containers you can't even open. Watermelon seeds we don't really need. Tallow we don't really need. We don't really need anything. Although the Kevlar would be nice. Electrical parts. Electronical parts. Um, I shouldn't say we don't need anything. We need a lot of things. But I know we don't need potato sprouts now. <laughs> There's some Kevlar, that's real nice. Plastic and clay. Um, yeah, a lot of the stuff that we're getting, like clay and so forth, I mean, we can obviously procure that ourselves, but when we get it free like this, then that's less grind for us, right? Um, I didn't see a bookshelf in here that had any tech on it, though. Did I miss something? Let's do a one more once over. I don't think all the houses necessarily have tech, but I don't want to. I don't want to have to backtrack. Um, oh wait, did I miss this whole bookshelf right here? It's not on there anyway. Ah, stuck. All right, let's get to the next house. Let's boogie. Uh, plant fiber and nails. Come on, tech. Come on, tech. No tech. Iron ore is fine. No tech here either. Rope. Electronics. Would it be great? Oh, mechanical parts. Fantastic. Those are kind of hard to see. If I'm missing something, then let me know down in the comments, and I'm sure you will. Um, I'm not sure we're going to come back here anytime soon, but at least you can berate me and call me a fool. That's fine, too. A bunch of stuff up here. Oh, electronics parts are good. All right, let's keep moving. It's now 325. We've got to push, push, push. Uh, who that? Sally! In we go. Please be some tech here. No tech. What the heck is going on? How about this bookshelf? No tech. Alright, this is nuts. We need the technology. We are striking out. 
I mean, getting plenty of loots, but no technology. Nothing. No tech in this house either. That's the third house. No technology. All right, out we go. Sun is still shining, fortunately. All right, let's go back and get the cart. By the way, the cart now shows up on the map. <laughs> it's a little red dot in case you lose it. All right, let's go check out these houses over here. Where were they? To the right. Right to the right. Oh, boy. Release. Release Mario. And get the bow. Let's see if this guy backs off. Oh, he's thinking about it. And he's running. <laughs> he shook. You see him shaking? It was Fred. Fred didn't want to mess today. Oh, there he goes. He's still running. Hi, Fred. Where's the fire? He's thinking about it. <sighs> You know what, Fred? I don't have time to wait for you to make a decision. So, goodbye. There we go. We made Fred's decision for him. Uh. All right, yeah, these are new houses. We haven't been here yet. We should leave the doors open so we know. Yeah, we just, we just got unlucky with the houses in the beginning. Three houses, no tech. Ooh, big second floor. Oh, that that's a tech. Wind turbine! That'll provide power! Yeah! That's a good one! Alright, there's one more tech in this town. I'm hoping it's either the advanced workbench or the, um... What was the other one? The stove? Stove would be good to make some nice meals. I guess we can leave this building now. We're not gonna find two techs in one building as far as I know. Alright, so we were just a little unlucky in the beginning. So let's go, let's go check the other one. And where's my car at? Where's Mario? There he is. Hey, Mario. All right, latch on. And let's go to the big green house. So I wonder if it's the same house type. Oh, whoa. That's, uh, that's Fred. Run, I don't have my bow up. And he's got a knife in his hand. Ay, ay, ow, I'm stuck. Come on. Oh, is my cart still attached to me? <laughs> Who's I carrying the cart all the way up here? I think I released it, didn't I? Oh, no, it's right here. Oh, my God. Did I just put the cart under Fred? Look what you've done. Look what you have done, Fred. He's running. Come on. Get pep, pep, pep. Oh, oh, you. Man, he's deacon and dodging, and he doesn't know what he wants. There we go. Did I put the cart under the porch? Oh, yeah, I see it. I see Mario. Mario. <laughs> Mario's under the porch. How can I get you, buddy? There he is. Okay, we got him. We got him. We got him. We got him. Whew. That would have been a disaster had we lost poor Mario. Okay, Mario, you're fine, but Stay mario E. Okay. He just changed his name. Let's get inside. It's raining out. Let's get the final tech and we can get the heck out of here. It's 6.30. Holy cow. Time is flying. Flying when you're having fun, huh? Oh, we need one more tech. That's a dry brick. Oh my gosh. Maybe it's up on the second floor? Hmm. Nothing. No tech anyway. Alright, let's get to the next house, which... Um... Is over here, right? Alright, let's go grab... Let's go grab mario -y. <laughs> And go around back. So this town is actually much larger than I had at first assumed. There's plenty of houses here, although we did we do these houses? There's a little this is a little one. I remember going in a little house. Oh someone in the house? Close it. Who's that? Well, Fred, don't you throw that knife, buddy. Alright, let's look for the tech while Freddy's outside. Uh fish oil. I don't see the tech here either. More tater sprouts, bark chips we don't need. Yeah, yeah, I know you're out there. Keep your pants on. Hey, don't you take my Mario. He's, he's climbing on the Mario. All right, let's get the bow. We might be able to get a shot here. Can I open the door with, yep. Oh, jeez. <laughs> How many knives does he have? Oh, he grabbed me. He bit me or something. Hey, I think he held on to me or something. I got stuck there. In the door. Wow, Fred. 
and we have an infection, so we have to... We need to clear up the infection. Fortunately, Sally gave us a medicated bandage. Um, and our health is at 64. I think we'll survive. Oh, my gosh. Here comes Sally. Oh, whoa, where's my arrow? Where's my arrow? Whoa! Oh, got her. <laughs> oh, she's got me. See, they hold on to you now. What's up with that? De oh, she went poof. That's a new, uh, new, new ability. It's a new... Uh, a new teleport ability. Holy cow, she is doing a number on me. Let's use that up. She's still back there? Yeah, she's still back there. And she went poof again. This katana doesn't do very much damage, does it? Wow. Let's go back and get Mario, and let's get to another house. Alright, I think... I think this may be the last house. Not entirely sure. They're all looking kind of the same. Um, but the doors close, so I'm assuming we have not been here yet. Though I don't see anything on the shelves. Maybe we've been here, we missed. No, we didn't. There's uh, some bio. Oh, there we go. There we go. Stove tech. Yes, that's what we wanted. Let's grab all the biofuel. And I uh, don't really need the rope. Um, let's just have a quick look around here and grab. Whatever we can, and then we're gonna boogie. Don't really need the plant fiber. Just picking stuff up now. Random like. Let's see if there's anything up here. Ugh. It's always tough to get up over that little hump there. Um, glass. Yay. Glass is good. Alright, we gotta go. Because we're gonna be running through the dark. I don't really wanna do that. It's 9 20 p.m. Holy cow. Yeah. I'm surprised it's not, not pitch black already. It's going to be a run through the dark, my friends. It's going to be rather terrifying. But we got our two techs. That's great. Stove tech and the uh, wind turbine tech. Which sounds pretty amazing. Whoa, boy. Oh, you know what? Let's just shoot. It's the best way to do it. Whoa. Oh, oh you. How many knives do you have, bro? Looks like you had two knives. Did you have two knives? I don't know. I dodged the first one. It looked like you had another one on him. Let's, uh, oh, can't, oh my gosh, here they come, they're all coming now, coming out of the woodwork, I see you, Sally, behind the rock, whoa, 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 whoa le leaper, she's a leaper, oh gosh, oh my, <laughs> yeah, they're all coming out now, oh boy, there's Freddy boy, he turned, I think I lost Sally, Fred's thinking about it, too late, Fred, oh, Sally, and a headshot, man, the butt shots don't seem to do very much damage. Let's grab Freddy over here. There's his knife. Um, oh gosh, I'm getting dizzy. Thirsty. Thirsty. Eat that. Drink that. Eat that. Alright, vitals are okay. Um, 13 arrows left. And it's late. Let's grab old Mario here. And let's go. East. Out of town. Alright, it's going to be a kind of a scary run. We might get a Vambier or two on the way. And possibly a Predator. <laughs> but uh, we got our attack, and that's, that's important. So I will meet you back at base, assuming I can make it in one piece. Okay, I think we're almost home. I see lights in the distance. That's, yes, that's the base. Tuna Pond base, here we are. Alright, let's park Mario E out here. In fact, why don't we just get rid of that E now? That was just a panic move. <laughs> Look at all the good stuff here in Mario. I'm going to go ahead and take some time to get organized. Whoop, can I just get the whole stack over? And uh, yeah, I'll see you all in the next episode. This is going to take some time. And in the next episode, I think what we'll do is we'll make up the solar panel and take a look at our new techs now that we have stove tech and uh wind turbine right let's check out that stove right here metal stove 25 iron ingots that's going to take a while to get but it's going to be great for making um uh, making some some stews and we can make the sink now probably we have enough aluminum for that so we can get fresh water and of course the uh the power we got we got two different options now actually solar panel and wind turbine so we'll take a look at all that in the next episode so with that my friends we'll see you hope you enjoyed this episode and oh boy heavy 
Woo. Um, I think I'm gonna need another stone bin here, aren't I? Yeah, it looks like it. Wow. Great. I like having stones. And we'll make the stone grinder too, which I think... I don't know if we have to find that technology. Where is it? Under others. Yeah, it's right here. It, it doesn't require a new technology, but we do have to come up with the six mechanical parts and 12 electrical parts. I don't think we have that, so we might have to wait up, wait on that one. <laughs> Look at this. Look at all the ores going into the foinus. Wow. We are loaded up. We're going to have plenty of metal for the next episode, I think, so it shouldn't be too much trouble making some cool stuff. Finally, we're getting ahead of the curve, I think, my friends. So, yeah, that's it for now. Uh, we shall see you all in the next episode. So, have a good day. Bye-bye.